welcome back to my channel i'm zen if you're new here welcome today i've got a haul so it's not a very big haul but um <laughs> kind of got the table covered with a few things here this one's really huge a couple boxes here i got a couple things from home goods like the you know just at the store and then there's a mirror there so not a ton, but I wanted to go ahead and share these things with you guys. I got these things like a couple days ago, so I've been dying to get them open for you. So let's go ahead and dive into it. Now, I do want to let you know, I've been filming a vlog all weekend. It's Sunday. <laughs> so I've been filming a vlog all weekend, and I wasn't sure if I was going to include this in the vlog, if that would make it too long or not. Once I put together the footage, we'll see. So you may or may not be seeing this as part of the vlog or on its own. So either way, if you happen to watch both, then you'll see me in the same outfit. So that's why. <laughs> All right, let's get into it. Um, I'll go ahead and do this one here in the front since we're here. I did go ahead and open it just to save a little time, but I haven't actually seen the item. So. This is from Z Gallery. I ordered a bunch of things from them actually. Only one's come so far. And I think the rest is supposed to come either tomorrow or the next day. So I could have waited to do that haul, but I just wanted to go ahead and keep these open. Like I said, this stuff has already been sitting here a couple days. So, um, you yeah, know, I've been patient. camera but um, in person it's quite yellow which I don't I don't love but I don't hate so we'll see I mean otherwise though the vase is super cool <laughs> I thought it was quite unique it's got a good weight to it I mean it's pretty heavy you can see lined up with like my head and everything it's it's long um, Hello. And it's just like, oh, just gold on the inside, I guess. I thought it was black, but, well, I can't really tell. <laughs> um, so the regular price of it was $100, but I think I paid 70 So I didn't think that was too bad. This is quite unique, but I'll have to see. I was thinking about putting this in the living room on one of the media consoles. So I'll have to see how it looks, um, again, because it's, it's very yellow. <laughs> and I was looking for more of like a kind of brushed gold. So we'll see. Um, here's a kind of boring item. These are from Amazon, so I know. nearby playing in the boxes so just be aware of that but I ordered a bunch of temporary blinds on Amazon so I thought so right now the front of our house is our dining room and our office I thought well I don't have any sort of window coverings in there right now and it's not really been a big deal but because I still don't really know what direction I'm going in I figured it's the time to probably just go ahead and get something just for a little more privacy I would feel more comfortable so they're just like the temporary paper ones our windows are quite wide so it'll need like two of these and then I think I'll have to extend them on the bottom too because they're pretty long windows too so ordered a bunch of those uh they came in packs of six 
I ordered two of them, so we've got 12 total. And it's just like an adhesive at the top. And so you just stick them on there and let it hang. So pretty easy. Again, meant to be temporary. <laughs> Don't keep these up in your windows, but I know a lot of people use this for new construction homes because of course they don't usually include window coverings when you're buying. Um, I thought we would have some by now, but you know, whatever. So anyway, these will be going up. I'll probably do that tomorrow. So maybe I'll film that, we'll see. Um, and I don't remember how much they were, but they were pretty cheap, like 20 something for a pack of six, I think, or maybe even like $18. Somewhere between $18 and $26, if that's helpful. Um, let's go ahead and do this giant box. So this is from Home Depot. Let me get it open as best I can. I'll just bring it a little closer. Like, it looks pretty real. Look at that. You can't tell me that doesn't look real. Like, the color and everything is so good. And it's in like a, let me show you, a pot on the bottom. So I've gotta unwrap that. But yeah, it's not like very cool. Like I've looked at the olive trees like from like Pottery Barn and stuff, but I want $300 for a fake tree. I'm like, babe, I'm sorry, I, I don't, I mean, y'all know, y'all see my house and you see some of the things I haul, like I don't mind spending money, but not on something that's like stupid. Like I could get a real tree for $300. You know, and no shade to the people who have paid for it. I'm just saying for me, that's a little rough. But anyway, so I'll play around with that. But hopefully you guys have some idea of what it looks like. But I'm actually pretty happy. <laughs> this looks really good. Um, like I said, I have to undo the pot thing. It's not like a decorative planter pot. It's pretty plain, so I'll have to transfer it into something. But this, I'm thinking, will go in the foyer. So I ordered a bench, which that's going to be coming this week, too. So I'll have that update for you. And this tree, I'm thinking, will go next to the bench. So we'll see. It may or may not work. You know how these things go. I have a vision in my mind. <laughs> we'll see if, the, if it comes to life or maybe it could even go by the foyer like console table I ordered one of those too that will come either this week or the following week it's got kind of a uh, an open period there so we'll see but or even over here on the side of the door so there are options I think I will be able to use it either way we'll see um, but yeah I'm happy with it this was like a hundred dollars or like a hundred and ten like something like that which isn't bad like I said this is like a third of what they're going for on like uh, you know Pottery Barn, West Elm, any of those type of places so I say it's a win all right let's go ahead and move on I'll put this uh, we'll just put it over here Next, I've got some 
something I ordered from. I'm sure you guys have probably heard of like this website called Hows. Like it's H-O-U-Z-Z. And they are kind of like, I don't know. They sell different brands and stuff. So anyway, I got this on there. I can't really like totally explain it. By the way, we are in my dining room, so see the light fixture. I tried to save time by opening the box, but now there's another box in here that needs to be opened, so let me go ahead and do that real quick. I, mean, I do appreciate good packaging so that nothing is damaged. Okay, so we've got part one, a lamp shade. So that obviously means we ordered a lamp. I just want to bring this closer so you guys can see it. It's just like a white, maybe off-white, but nice round cylinder shape. Nothing special, but um, it's, it's quite large. I mean, you can see it's big. <laughs> So we'll set that down. Let me show you the base. Um, let's see. Um, okay. So I've got like the hardware here. beautiful I just didn't know it was so heavy that's why the price was what it was <laughs> um, so I'm thinking that this will go in the foyer on the console table once it arrives um, like I said um, the console table is pretty small it's black I got the pottery barn and then this is clear, and then with the white lamp shade, I think it'll just tie it all in together. Um, our chandelier that we just got installed, you'll see that in the vlog, is uh, like silver, you know, nickel. And so I'm just trying to tie in everything together. So we've got the black in the office, and then there's black, gold, and clear in here. So anyway, <laughs> Hopefully, like I would have loved a statement lamp in like a cool color, but I don't want there to be too much going on in the foyer, you know, because I have that flower wallpaper that you can see in my office right from the floor or right from the foyer. Plus, I want a style that's gonna be something timeless that I won't, you know, my style changes. <laughs> you know how we women are, we like to change things up, so I don't want to commit to something too specific that I may not like in a year. Luna, what are you doing to the lamp? Shane. <laughs> we'll let her hang out here, but if she starts acting 
acting crazy, I'm gonna kick her off the table. Okay, moving on. <laughs> I've got this really large mirror, so you're not really gonna be able to see it very well. Well, it's not really that heavy, so I can lift it for you. The lamp is actually heavier than this, I think. <laughs> Um, ooh, these hips. <laughs> but yeah, it's, it's funny. You can see the office right across and then the camera, but it's just silver with a, I mean, I don't know how to describe it. It's a pretty simple mirror. I got it at Home Goods. It was $100. I was actually hoping to put this above the vanity in the guest bathroom down here, but it's just like an inch too wide. <laughs> So I'm just like, grr. <laughs> I do like the mirror and I don't think it's a bad price. So I may, I don't know that I really have use for it anywhere else. It is a bit glam, which I wanted that glam touch in the bathroom, but I don't really need it anywhere else. So we'll see. Cause my style isn't totally glam. I just like a touch of glam. <laughs> and so, yeah, I may have to return it, but um, they have really like a lot of nice mirrors there if you guys are interested or, you know, get creative with your mirrors over your vanity. They don't have to be vanity mirrors. They can be anything. So, and I wanted something that was a taller height too, but anyway, this will probably go back. So put that to the side. You know, maybe it's a little bit nicer, hold up nicely. So that was only four dollars for the cups and the spoons. I thought that was pretty good. And then lastly, I found this tray. So again, it is a little bit more on the glam side. I'm not sure exactly how I feel about it or how I use it, but I got it as an option. <clears throat> to go either in the living room on one of the consoles or in our master bedroom on like the nightstand or the media console. So it's gold and this is more of a brushed gold like what I wanted. I don't know if you can kind of compare it to that more yellow gold. It's that brand Tahari Home, so Ellie Tahari. And it's got a mirrored base, literally $30. There's a peek at the chandelier, if you haven't seen it. <laughs> but anyway, so I thought that was a pretty good price. Um, we'll see if I use it or not, and if I return it, I'll let you guys know. But um, so that is pretty much it for today's haul. We ended up with <laughs> the tree, the tray, the vase, the lamp, the temporary blinds, uh, well, I would say the mirror, but it'll be returned, and then the measuring cups, and that's pretty much it. So, like I said, nothing crazy, but I wanted to keep you guys updated. We got lots more new things coming, so stay tuned. I appreciate you watching my videos. Hope you have a wonderful day. I'll see you next time. Bye.